boxers, and as you can tell, our box is so yes. large that um, you can't even see the bottom of Tuffy's feet. Check it out. We have for you Red Hood. The Red Hood. The PVC diorama of Red Hood. Wow. This hood is very shiny red. Yes, it is. <laughs> so we want to say a great big thank you to... Diamond Select. For sending him to us for free to share with you today. So, um, and add to our PVC diorama collection, um, which we should do a video of that pretty soon. A little bit of what we got going on. Which, yeah. you know, display. But anyway, so this is Red Hood. This is comic book version or? Yes, comic know. version. All right, so. So let's see. Let give you an idea what it looks like. Ta-da! So it's got a little um, bio of Red Hood, which is actually pretty small. This dynamic gallery diorama of Red Hood, a.k.a. Jason Todd, is based on his appearance. Oh, and DC Comics, it is cast in durable, high-quality PVC and features detailed sculpting and collectible quality paint applications designed by Sean Knapp and sculpted by Joe Mena. So he's got such a long backstory that maybe they decided <laughs> that uh, I guess so. Yeah, if you they didn't have much room after they put the picture in. That's there. right, but that is an awesome picture of the of the diorama on the back. Really cool. So you were saying that basically it was a Robin Joker. Yeah, the second Robin Jason Todd um there was a uh, a storyline in the comics called Death in the Family where at the end of the storyline mm -hmm. the Joker has him and is going to kill him mm -hmm. and you basically got to call in and decide whether you wanted him to live or die. Oh no. Um, it was the craziest thing back in the day when it Did happened. you call in? I did not. <laughs> but um, but yeah he ended up dying um, but then later he gets put in the Lazarus pit, the Ra's al Ghul's Lazarus pit and they bring him back to life, and he's not quite all there, so he becomes the Red Hood and kind of takes justice into his own hands. And, and then eventually he eventually, learns yeah. the correct way to do justice. All right, so we're going to get Red Hood out of this box and come back and give you a closer look. We'll be right back. Okay, and there's Red Hood out of the box. So I'm a little, what is he standing on? Looks like I think another he, building top thing. I'm guessing. Yeah. Whoa, check it out. Maybe it's one of those. You know how they have those? Like steam pipe. I mean, see. Um, I don't know, I'm guessing it's probably like a, supposed to be on the rooftop, but I'm, yeah. all I can think of is those, um, like in New York, where there's just those big concrete things in the middle of the street. That, oh, yeah, yeah. That's like um, a barrier thing. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it definitely looks like that. It could be. But, I mean, you know, like, what do you have to, like, jump up and do that and on that yeah. little teeny <laughs> barrier? But anyway, let's go ahead and take a look at him close up. Oh, he's very light. So, um, let's take a look awesome awesome paint job on his red hood it is metallic red metallic yeah, I love the looking. way the, the insignia and the hood are metallic and everything else is like matte right this makes me think of the um the red and black the batwoman with the red and mm -hmm. black um and um so his his hood is it's like his whole thing it's mm -hmm. hood right. face and all he's got little white eye holes right there he's got his hand and a fist so he is ready to do some damage here and uh, so he's got the brown jacket, and then he's got. Um, this looks kind of like armor, like an armor yeah, I'm sure type it's like shirt. Like a body armor, yeah. Yeah, and then look at this. How his waist is twisted, like in just that right position. And mm -hmm. You can, you know, he's rearing back to do yeah. something, which is really cool how they captured that. Um, and then there's his awesome shoes. Looks like they're like designer shoes or something. And then oh, he has a he has a place on the side, two places on the side. For some he's got weapons. holsters, but yeah. I don't know where he's... Yeah, that's what he, he's are. chasing, the guy who took his yeah. <laughs> weapons. Yeah, weapons. And um, he's got this really awesome sword, very well painted and crafted, and he's holding it in his hand. Is that his weapon? Like, yeah. normal weapon? Okay. And um, let's take a look at the back. The back of the jacket. It's one of those, like, shorter jackets, like a waist jacket. And um, he is kneeling on this, and the belt looks really cool. Awesome. So um, this is definitely a different pose than anything I've seen. Yeah. You've got the tread on the back of his foot, and then you can see right here how they've done the uh, the detailing to make it look, you know, not just like straight painted. Right, right, it's right. It's got some depth to it, and um, some it looks realistic that way. How they've done like the it's like a silver, silver brown kind of thing, almost like a lead looking thing. Yeah. Very cool. Awesome. So, um, he, yeah, he's, he's very light, but very detailed. 
as you can see there's you know this is this is hollow so he's not going to be um, super heavy on any shelf right. that you're going to put him on awesome or he's going to look good next to robin and nightwing and awesome Batgirl yeah and the rest of the he's going Batman to join family. the dc universe yes all right so we want to say another great big thank you to diamond select for sending him to us for free to share with you today. It sure has been fun taking a look at Red Hood. Uh, we do not do many Red Hood items. No. And um, this might be even our first. I think so, so, yeah. As always, come back and see us. Like, subscribe, and we will see you next time.